Hey folks, welcome back to After Work Gaming. We are back in the Solus Project, and we are here in the underground caves, and as I promised, I'm pretty sure I said it in the comments, and if not, then should've, uh, we are gonna keep exploring this big area that we saw back here. Now, we found an artifact through this little passageway here. This is kind of like a weird side piece from the pillar room, if you, if you recall. But there was this huge cavern through there that I still want to uh, explore a little bit because I feel like there's got to be something there, right? We ran around, we didn't see anything. Uh, so I dropped the teleporter just so we can get back quickly in case we get ourselves stuck in some way. And let's continue on. There are these things here at the ceiling. We are good for food, good for water. We do have five hours of sleep and I would like to have a little bit more. Okay, so one, two, right? Ooh, come on. There we go. One and two on the ceiling. We can skirt them, and let's continue on. Now, let's see, let's see. I feel like we were over there, we checked down there, we checked over there. Check this area of the pool. It's through here. We didn't, I don't think we ever looked here very well. And, uh, yeah, it shows, because we missed this. We missed this giant ladder. Okay, let's climb up. Uh, this is marked, or this was warned to us to be like a, a an advanced cave, I guess, for advanced explorers, and that usually means some sort of hazard that we'll have to deal with. And that's fine. I understand that. Still have 4.3 hours of sleep. What is this? The Upholding One of One. Okie dokie. Um, is there anything down here? No. Yeah, I know. I see the structure off to the left. I see it. Let's just explore down to the end of this cave and see if there's anything here. And then we'll check out that structure area. Okay, okay, okay. Weaving through the pillars. Not really seeing anything. In fact, I'm not really seeing that you can get over this. I think this really is just a dead end. Yeah, 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 okay. Alright, let's check out this structure then. Unless there's a way around here somewhere. Yeah, it is, there is. Oh wait, all roads lead to the structure. <laughs> okay. Alright. And it's locked. So there's got to be a mechanism around here, because look, they have the gears. Um... Of course not. Oh, of course. Interesting. Okay. Let's go back and see if we can find some place to activate. Like right here. Hello. This is one of those you gotta stand on it situations. Okay. 3.7 hours of sleep. Fine. And look, the door is opening. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That curiosity. Yeah, it's 70 degrees with the torch. 40 degrees without. I'd rather be with torch. Uh, let's see. Okay. Slopes off. Looks like a dead end. No, it isn't. Look, there's there's like cobwebs or something over here. That means we can go through. Is there anything over here? Before we go off and run around? That's just a pillar. There is. Okay, fine. Let's go and find out what's through here first, through here, and then we'll go check out what's off to the other side, because that's an easy enough to follow fork. And to the extent possible, I'd like to avoid using our teleporter, because then we can quickly get back to the main fork in the road, and then get back to, like, the pillar area. There it is. There's the uh, spike on the ceiling, or a spike that comes down from the ceiling. Skirt under it, under it, under it. Perfect. Okay. It's the same one? Right, it's the same passage all roads lead here. Fine. Um. What's this? 
Ring requires rope used to repel. No, we're not gonna do that right now, thank you. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, easy. Um, actually, hold on, let's just skirt the outside here of this hole, perfect. I could kind of, I think if I really tried, I could probably jump down there without using a rope. And there looks like a cavern is up there, okay, um, let's try and make it down here without killing ourselves, okay? It's incredibly dumb, but we can do this. I have faith. There we go. Easy. 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 Nice. Perfect. Okay, so, no need for a rope to repel, thank you. What else is down here? Uh, oh, there's a passage. In fact, that is the passage. Fine. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. So, now this opens up to a huge cave. Please don't tell me that we're gonna have, like, this dead fo No, but there is something over there. Look, the green. Okay. We'll deal with that in a second. It looks like an artifact, but we'll deal with it in a second. Let's just run past it right now. And... It's over here. Big ol' nothing. Right? Right. Okay, let's go back and check out what this artifact is. Uh, Lost Artifact, Treaty of the Cove, upgrades all resistances. And we'll take that, thank you. We are at two and a half hours of sleep. Let's see if we can make it to that second cave and see if we can find anything. Because to the extent possible, I would like to not sleep here. Alright, so we're ba getting back to where we were supposed to quote-unquote repel, and we're just going to climb the side again. Probably just make us more tired. Because it's just going to involve hopping around. There we go. There we are. There we are. Out of the cave. Perfect. So we got to go up there. 2.3 hours. That's fine. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Perfect. Okay, so this is where we would have climbed up if we could the last time, and I'm seeing the, uh, the telltale arrows here. Look at that. Um, but we won't go to the glowworm here, piece here first. Maybe we will. Hold on. What's up here? I saw, I see a pot. See this thing? There it is. Oh, there's nothing else. Uh, this... Right here, it looks like what we were seeing from the other side of the, like, the structure entrance area, entrance way. In fact, I'm pretty sure this is exactly where this leads. I'm almost positive now. Um, let's not get there yet. Let's instead... Whoops, two, uh, two hours of sleep and it's already giving me a warning. That's fine. Let's quickly explore down what, what is over here. This area. Right? Is that the only area we can go to? Yes. Yes, it is. Okay, that's, that's that. Let's go up here real quick. Easy, easy, easy. We'll take a nap pretty soon. I'm seeing more pots. That's cool. Hello. Strange skull recovers health infinite. Unique. What the heck? Okay, we're not going to use that. But, uh, okay, so that is an alien head. Or an alien skeleton. Fine. Weird little artifact we just picked up. Uh, okay, okay. 1.6 hours of sleep. Yeah, I really, really, really need a nap. I know. But I really, really, really want to continue looking around without having to take a nap, per se. No, 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 no. Okay, let's not go here yet. Is there anything off to the side? No. Okay, fine. We'll get to like an hour of sleep and then we'll go from there, okay? Or go from there meaning we'll take a nap. Uh, 
Is there really nothing else? I just want to make sure. Like right here, is there nothing else? Easy. Easy. Right, so that's where we left off with the, um... That's where the thing is that comes out of the, the ceiling. Fine, this is the repel area. Okay. Where are we? 1.3. Let's get back up there. Let's just scramble up the rock face. Perfect. Shortage of sleep. I know. I know. This is the other side of the repel area, right? Yes. Yes, it is. Um, okay. Fine. Let's get to... Easy, easy, easy. Fine. Glowworm cave to... Not there. We'll go here. One point one hours, perfect. I know I don't want to. I mean, it's not great sleeping here because it is pretty chilly with this thing here, but that's fine. So let's take a nap. We're at one hour. Let's take a nap for seven hours. I have food. I have water. And I'll see you guys on the other side. Good. We're at seven, uh, eight hours of sleep. We need food. We need water. Let's drink a bottle of water. We're good for water. Let's eat one of these things. We're good for food. Perfect. So now we can continue on from here. Is there a way to get over there quickly and more efficiently than jumping up here? Nope, there isn't. That's fine. Easy, 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 easy. Shh, 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 shh. Okay, good. Good. Uh, I'm seeing pots, but pots by themselves don't do anything for me. And we've managed to... Uh, uh, we've managed to loop around. Good. Okay, cool. Let's... Let's go back. Uh, let's go back, he says. Let's go back. Uh, and let's go back to the pillar room, then. That was actually quite, uh, quite a useful little trip. I don't know what the skull does, but we haven't really done anything that needs us to regain health. So we'll be okay for now. Maybe it's like an infinite medikit, in which case I can drop a lot of the other medikits and just run around with that skull. Um, which would be pretty cool. Alright, so, back through here, right, back through here. And back into the pillar room, and now, remember, we arranged them last time in a way that we can quickly tell quickly. We can teleport. Right, I have my teleportation tool here. Let's go back down. We arranged them in a way so that we can teleport from one to the other to the next. Uh, and reach the other side, which would be great. Uh, and I did before I, you know, before we went off to this side piece, I did test it out. It just, just works. It does take a little bit of fiddling. So, uh, if it's one of those things that does require a little bit of fiddling from me, um, I may cut it and just, you know, you'll have to just trust me that it actually worked. <laughs> trust me, it actually works. Right, right. Almost. Oh, there we go. Off the edge. Oh, off the edge. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, what is that? Oh, it's another one of these containers. You know, also the benefit is we don't need those containers anymore. We don't need these, right? Because recovers health infinite and unique. In theory, should obviate the need for those sort of things. Nope. Okay. Uh, all right, we're on the other side. Let's keep going. Uh, we still have to follow this cable, I think. Uh, this is really, really, really an old passageway because there has been a lot of 
I want to say cobwebs, but I don't think there are spiders on this planet. It's got to be something else, right? There's like probably another uh, another creature that does that. That does the same thing for like put up webs. Um, okay. Anything there? Nope. All right, so we saved. So let's continue on. Seeing, yeah, it is a staircase. Hallways of Darkness 2. Oh! Oh! oh. That's, um... The skull! Use the skull! Infinite. Operator health improved. Oh, it gives me ten. Yeah, ten at a time. Okay, let's eat this thing. Twenty-five? Guys, you got to be kidding me. Alright, fine. 270. That was horrifying. Run. Okay, so these things still pump out like... That is one hell of a booby trap, guys. Okay, and what is this? I really don't like that. I don't like anything about this. I also don't like the fact that they actually exist here. That's right. What are you? Why are you here? <laughs> okay, let's continue on. What the hell? Are you... What the hell? Whoa, 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 whoa. Well, that explains many different things and raises many, many more questions. You guys saw that, right? There was like a creature or a figure up there. Oh, this is not going to be good. Listen, Wilson, I'm dealing with something here, okay? Meaning I'm freaking out. Always of darkness, right? Right. Okay, let's read this stuff. Enlightened Sanctuary 1 of 1. Built on Galea in the third year after Exodus at the Archipelago of Dawn. Okay, so that's here. So that so the, the cable now ends here. Great. Fantastic. Uh, that creature, by the way, had this very very. What is this? A shield. A shield. Uh, sure. Okay. Uh, we'll get there in a second. Let's just look around outside this. I can only imagine that this is a temple. Look at this place. Very temple-like. Rocks, who cares? Okay, let's start exploring these doorways. Maybe there's gonna be like a... Yeah, 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 yeah. Maybe there's gonna be like a weak wall here somewhere. Hmm, an Ankh, by the way. It's kind of interesting. There's another one. But this looks like a, this looks like a grave. These all look like graves. Oh my god, what? Okay, second door. This is not a grave site, although there are dead people here, or dead aliens. Um, Galeans, I guess? Yeah, 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 I'm jumping on their table, I know. I'm terrible. But, no, this is like a feast table or something. Maybe this isn't just a temple. Maybe the people lived here. Um, this one's lying in state. It does have a long, an elongated skull. Okay, I'm uh, I'm officially freaked out. Okay, so this had a crystal in it, I think. Right? Yeah, this red crystal here, the fire crystal, light crystal, whatever. Nineteen of twenty-four. Now we have two of these. 
We should have more than one of these, although I think I may have left one in Yuri's cave. It's fine. Oh, yes. Food. I do need water, though. What is this? Another sword. Okay, I now have a sword and a shield, which is... something. Kind of need more water, though. That's what I need. I need to refill my water bottles, drink. It'd be helpful. Rocks. I can set fire to this if I need to, but I don't need to. Plenty of bodies. Or plenty of skeletons, rather. Uh, there's more of these. I would like to think these are not toilets. I don't know why my immediate thought to that is, but this dude sitting on them is, you know, a thing. Okay. Let's go upstairs to the next level, I guess. It's kind of like this, I mean, like, this kind of, like, gives us a little insight into how their lives went, I guess. This is like a, a communal sitting room or dining room. More pots, more pots, skulls, hands. What is going on around here, man? Another onk. Skulls. Skulls without jaws, by the way. That's something. Water. Yes, 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 yes. Water, water everywhere. Just enough to drink. Okay, we've refilled our water bottles. I'm gonna run around with the skull a little bit. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we can at least get to 300. That's good. Because next time we take a nap, it'll go up anyway. We have a rock. This is closed. And I don't think... I don't think we'll be able to... Teleport through this right now. Because this is a very thin gap, and I don't think it'll actually fit through there. But let's see. Maybe there's going to be, like, a weak wall here. No, no. Weird. Weird. Why, like... The thing... Here's the thing. I don't know, and it's very hard to... Weak wall. There we go. I was thinking there would be something. But, um... Uh, it's very hard for me to tell why all these... And I can't figure out why all these bodies are here. And they're just kind of... Hmm? They're, like, propped up against the walls and stuff. It... Get the torch. Perfect. Oh, this is just health kits. Just health kits, guys. Cool, but ultimately not very helpful. Okay. But this is interesting. So they sealed themselves off and barricaded themselves in here with, like, health kits, right? Weird. I wonder what they were hiding from. So that, but that also adds a little bit more explanation to what I was going to say. You know, these bodies that are sitting against the walls or lying around like this, right? It's unclear to me because there, some of these guys look like they were, they died where they were, but also some of them look like they died waiting for something or trying to avoid something. And I don't think this is just like ceremonial in state or whatever. These guys were sleeping in a bed together. Dude's watching them. That's kind of weird. Um. No, 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 nothing. Good for food, good for water. 4.2 hours of sleep. Just enough to get up here to the next level. I really don't know what happened on this planet. It's one of these very fascinating mysteries. And kudos to the, to the game for, you know... Keeping me guessing. Okay, water. What's here? Nothing. Okay, another barricaded room. Let's see. Where there's a barricaded room, there's usually... Yep, there is usually a weak wall. Let's take this wall down. Okay, one more, one more over here. Next one's over here. Next one's over here. And then over here. Get the torch back out. First things first, let's light these candles. Oh, that's pretty cool. Is 
like a stone fireplace with no real chimney, though. Okay, what else is in here? Relic of Day, resistance to heat stroke. Take that, thank you. Uh, this one's not barricaded. This is something that just collapsed, it looks like. Interesting. So, bottom line, some horrible calamity has befallen these people. And... Ouch. And it's not that hard... Uh, I mean, like, we it's not that hard to imagine that we already saw signs of this, is what I wanted to say, really. Um... So we saw signs, for example, that uh, a lot of the gravestones that were on the surface for, were for people who died around the same time. Okay, we're good for food, good for water. Okay. Let's go up one more step, one more flight. Okay, because this is like the ceremonial place here. We'll go check out what's in... Oh, hello. Is there something we can activate here? No. Let's see, let's see. Let's look around real quick. Okay, you guys heard that, right? What the heck was that sound? Oh, hello. Okay. Oh, this. Okay, fine. And then there's so three doors. Let's just quickly look at the other ones. And then there's up there. Uh, okay, well. Plenty of stuff to do. There are all these doors with mechanisms that we should probably explore. There's three in here. There's one in there. And, of course, there is the thing up there, which is where we saw the figure. Right there. Um, and we'll do that next time. If you guys enjoyed this, like, comment, subscribe, tell a friend. Let's me know that I'm doing something right. Let's me know that you guys want to see more of this stuff. If you have thoughts on the game, you think I'm overlooking something, you think uh, we could be doing something different, or you think I'm making a mistake somewhere, by all means, leave a comment. Everything's welcome, and in any case, I'll see you all next time.